Displacement, which I symbolize delta d, is the straight line difference between two points. The typical SI unit for displacement is meters, plus we need a direction for those meters. North, south, east, to the left, upwards, some kind of direction because displacement is what's called a vector quantity which has a magnitude, some number of meters for example with regard to displacement, but it also needs a direction. The key difference between distance and displacement, displacement is a vector and therefore must be reported with a direction. So if we have here a map for a bicycle race, let's say that the distance traveled is 52 miles. The displacement is simply 22 miles to the east. Not just 22 miles, but 22 miles to the east. Another introductory physics vocabulary term is velocity, which we symbolize by lowercase v. Velocity is displacement per time. If we want to write it in equation form, we might write it like this where these little arrows indicate that velocity 2, like displacement, is a vector. So the typical SI unit for velocity would be meters per second plus a direction because velocity, like displacement, is a vector and all vectors need to have a direction. So here's our bicycle race again and if we travel 52 miles along that curved route and we end up going 22 miles to the east if it takes us two hours to do that our speed would be 52 miles in two hours which would be 26 miles per hour that would be our average speed but our average velocity is our displacement divided by time. So our average velocity would be 11 miles per hour east.